Bienvenidos a Colombia. Today I got my snack crate for Colombia. I'm going to show you what's in it. So this is how it looks. I guess the stickers are inside. Preparate! So these are Colombian traditional things, stickers. We're going to open it and things probably got a little bit shifted around because I just lifted it up. So let's see what it looks like. Wow, look at all that. Ugh. Awesome. I'm gonna see what I can taste. Can I taste it all? Let me see, let's try these. It is Achiras del Uila. I don't know, whatever. It says these cheese crackers are made from Achira, a native plant that grows at high altitudes in the Andes region. So, we're gonna try these. Let's see what they taste like. You notice my nails are. The Colombian colors. Okay. Yes, this. I'm gonna just try this. It's baked in. Mmm. Those are not bad. Now, I do not like plantains or whatever they are. So we'll see if these actually are those. These crispy and lightly sweet plantain chips are a staple throughout Colombia. I'm gonna try these. Let's see what they taste like. Oh, they're actually like chip chips. Hmm. These actually aren't bad. They're not sweet. I know plantains look like bananas, but they're actually not bananas. And they're not really sweet. Maybe this is what plantains taste like. When I always had plantains, they were kind of fried, which was not that good. So I'm not sure about that. Oh, look at this. This is a chocolate I can only imagine that it's chocolate. Oh, there it is. So this is, this sweet pound cake covered in milk chocolate has been a Colombian staple since 1950. Okay. So that's what it is. So let's just take a little bite. It's a pound cake. It's chocolate. Oh, I like it. Do you see ya? I thought it was kind of like a brownie until I read pound cake. read some facts. Let's see. Who knows what the capital of Colombia is? Um, give up. Bogota. Okay. Uh, it was established in August 7th, um, 1819. Fun facts. Colombia is the second most biodiverse country in the world. Who knows what biodose means? Bogota has over 180 miles of bicycle route, the largest in South America. So we know that Colombia is in South America. <laughs> One out of every five butterfly species is found in Colombia. That's kind of cool. Um, look at all these things. Oh, actually they're here, so I won't show you there. Wow, look at these. Piazzi? I don't know, there's vanilla and then fresa. Preparate! Let's see where fresa is. Piazza fresa and vanilla, vanilla. Crisp wafer rolls filled with a sweet cream. We've included both strawberry and vanilla flavors. Ah, so fresa is strawberry. Awesome. I think I'm gonna try the strawberry. Let's see what this tastes like. They look like, well, actually an American treat, but I don't remember what it's called. Yeah, oh, it smells good. It smells like strawberry. Here we go. Mmm. Yeah. Tastes pretty much, much like American, um, the ones I'm talking about. I don't know the name. But it's probably maybe not American. It probably comes from another country. Oh, my word. Lokino. You see that? Lokino, these fruity chews are full of flavor and a great midday treat. We've included mango, cherry, peach, and pineapple flavors. 
Reminds me of Laffy Taffy. Um, not as chewy. Actually, yes, it's as chewy as Laffy Taffy, but it's not as hard to break. Okay. Mm, those are good. What else? Mm. Bacon chips. Bacon chips. <coughs> smells like bacon. All right, it looks just like bacon, but it's more like you know pig skin, which maybe this is what it is. Hmm. A little bit. Oh, let me try and pronounce it. Tocineta. Bacon chips. It, it's that part's in English. Um, Tocineta bacon chips. Light and crunchy chips featuring the savory taste of bacon with a hint of zesty lime. <laughs> so good. Actually, they're not that good. I just want to try it again. <laughs> oh man, there's a lot here. Look. That's all this candy, candy. A lot of candy. I don't want to open all of them because I won't eat them all today. Um, so I don't want them to get stale. <laughs> but these, they give you three of them. They look pretty good. Um, let me see. Oh, Jet. This rich milk chocolate bar is Columbia's favorite. As a fun bonus, each bar comes with a collective sticker. What? I want that sticker. Yes. Oh, look at these. Chalkies? Chalkies? And then Manny Mocha. I will try the Chalkies. Manny Mocha. Oh, the little thing. Okay, so they're little balls. Hmm. It wasn't empty. It's a little bit like um malted milk balls, like whoppers. Dang it. I'm trying to get the middle so you can see it. Oh yeah. Very light wafer thin. There goes your chocolate. These ones. I guess I'll open these soon. Just can't eat it every tonight. How many calories is that? <laughs> Ugh. Nope. Nope. Don't like these. Oh. There's a nut in it. I don't like them probably because they're healthy. I'm kidding. Okay, let me see what that looks like. So the chokies. Bite-sized puffed corn balls covered in milk chocolate. A delightful, unique snack experience. Yeah. But the Manny Mocos, no. Salt roasted peanuts covered in a hard shell made from flour. Each bite is crunchy burst of flavor. Um, cru, crujiente. I don't know what flour it is. There's four of these little glow pop things. Let me read a little bit. It is a bonbon bomb. Fruity lollipops with a bubblegum center that come in a variety of flavors. Look at all those fun things. There's three different sizes. The mini, which is $14, the box. And then you can do a premium, which comes with a few more things. Um, and then you can add a drink. I think it's for six bucks. I just opted for the middle one. Oh, here's these. <gasps> Coffee Delight. Yes, that's what I'm going to talk about. And then there's Bianchi Bar. So, that looks kind of like a Snickers or a Big Ruth. Bianchi Bar, a milk chocolate bar filled with peanuts and rich caramel. A perfect mix of sweet and savory into everything. So, I don't want to open everything like I keep saying, but I sure open it a lot because I want you guys to see if it's good or not. This looks so good. Maybe on chili or kind of matching the shirt. Size it not me trying to 
look, I'm wearing my Seahawks jersey. Yeah. I just want to thank you for watching. If it wasn't for Snack Crate, I couldn't do these cool little videos. And maybe I'll visit Columbia one day and I can practice some of my Espanol. Look at that cute sloth. I cannot even do it. Do they have sloths in Colombia? Because that is awesome. Play you. Maybe you got a sense of kind of what the snacks are in Colombia. And it's kind of fun things. for watching. I did not look that up. I lost most of my Spanish. <laughs>